where in turn one and two is a long straight but there is not so much space so actually probably the, the line is for one car only it's gonna be important to be in front of the guys the exit is also very important because after this there is a fast section that is going to another chicane so it's a very important part of the circuit I think it's a really good section. Obviously, it was the, the only change between season one and season two. Obviously, the braking is not so straight, so it's not so easy to come past. I think there's better opportunities uh, in other places in the track. We are at the exit of one of the tightest airpins of the circuit. Long straight line ahead, so obviously it is going to be a you know a very good overtaking point. At the moment, it's a little bit sandy, but you know we're on the beach, so it should all be fine for tomorrow when we race here. Yeah, very challenging chicane here. We're talking about uh, 100, 110 kph, so you have to be really precise to maximize everything. And also the exit is really important to be early on power for the rest of the track. I haven't driven here, so I'm trying to do my homework and find the best way possible. And uh, looking forward to do my first laps on this track. So it's turn 14, 15 for us. Very fast. You have to be very committed actually to make it well. You have then like a big long straight, so it's going to be very important actually to have like a very good exit. So remember actually to watch us and uh, see some action. We've come into sector three now. We've done the fast chicane. You've gone down the back straight and into another chicane. There's plenty of them on this circuit. By this point now, you're just looking to close out the lap, you know, in a good fashion. You've done the hard work and you don't want to muck it up going into the last three corners, especially in qualifying. So get there, be clean. Get into the last corner, again be clean, good exit, job done. For weekly Formula E videos, click subscribe on the left hand side. To watch the next one, click the icon in the centre and remember to hit the like button and leave your comments down below.